Well, if you ever have to visit the emergency room, you certainly know to expect a pretty big bill, but you expect top quality care for that. Well, get this. One tri-state woman got a huge bill for no care at all. Consumer reporter John Matarese is here with her story and a warning for all of us. John. Yeah, uh, Craig and Tanya, and on your side, here's from viewers about hospital overcharges all the time. But this is one of the biggest we've ever seen. Now, luckily, this tri-state woman's story has a happy ending. But you need to hear her story and know what to do if it happens to you. Judy Burton was feeling some pains on a recent Saturday night, so she rushed to the emergency room at the new Bethesda Butler County Hospital in Liberty Township. And she put a little hospital band on my wrist and, you know, told me to go to the waiting room. 45 minutes and a few magazines later. And my pain subsided. Mm -hmm. And I thought, you know, I'm not going to sit here. So she went home. But a couple of weeks later, she was hit by a different kind of pain, a bill for over $1,000. $1,059.06. For sitting in their chair in the waiting room and never saw anybody. At first, she didn't think much of it, figuring it was just a simple clerical error. She figured the hospital billed her for a full emergency room visit, not realizing she had left. But when she called, Judy says the hospital would offer only a payment plan. They said, well, we can give you financial assistance. And I said, uh, I'm not paying it. I never saw a nurse or a doctor. No vitals were taken. I sat in your chair. So she started filing an official dispute, but she says the next call she received was even worse. She says, well, you will be turned over to collections. And I thought, oh my gosh. But a nationally known patient advocate with BillAdvocates.com says ER surprises are now common. It, we're paying extreme costs that are not necessary. Pat Palmer told Not In Your Side's Kristen Hartman earlier this summer she commonly sees bills for things from $11 tissues to $50 latex gloves. We see gloves now at the price of $53 a pair. Palmer says if you feel you're overcharged, ask for a fully itemized bill, not just a summary. Tell the hospital you're disputing the bill. Tell them not to go to collections until the dispute's resolved, and then write a detailed list of the errors. But we have good news. After Not On Your Side contacted TriHealth, which runs Bethesda, spokesman Joe Kelly told us it was all a big error in the end. He says we inadvertently did not remove her visit from our tracking system when she left and a bill was processed when it should not have been. We've taken steps to ensure the situation does not happen again. So they're removing the entire charge and have just sent Judy these flowers to apologize. We want to thank TriHealth for resolving this so quickly, but there's a lesson here for everyone who ever gets an ER hospital or doctor bill that looks wrong. Be polite, but demand they itemize all the charges and then detail those mistakes in writing so you don't waste your money, Tiny. Some excellent advice in there. Thanks, John, and she got some flowers too. Mm.